motor pulled out of this Honda 38 HD 38 18 13. Gosh dang. There's the radiator. The super long PTO belt. The super complicated PTO clutch. It isn't engaged until the motor spins, or you pull the really hard to pull cable. But uh, yeah, it's got a timing belt. It's got all of it. It's got a fat carburetor. It's got a little snorkel on it to bring the intake up higher. This has got the flywheel set up like most motors do for the charging coil. You can see these two wires goes inside of the plate here and goes back here. It's got a plate on the back of the flywheel just like cars do. It's got a fuel pump. It's obviously water cooled. You know that by now. Got little cross members where the motor mounts onto. It's got this fat annoying plastic casing that tells all the retards how water cooling works. actually how to fill it because this thing doesn't come off all the way oh it comes off all the way look who's talking <laughs> that's your water pump and, and, and. I had battery problems so I, I installed all these heavy-duty cables and uh, we're working on the charging system right now which is on the back of there so yeah Pretty actually, it didn't want, want to fight me. It came out pretty easy, so I'm happy with it. Got all my wiring and relay crap like a little mini car. All right, well, I ended up having to impact it off the pulley, and uh, sorry, I had to get my light on. And I ended up using my wheel puller set to get this off. You can see the rest of the timing belt now. Pretty tight. I don't even know how that's tensioned, to be honest with you. I don't think it is. I think it just is put on there, and that's the way it is. But anyway, um, here's what our problem is. You've got these two items. And they're kind of old, and there's magnet dust everywhere. And I'm black now, and, you know, like, not to be racist, but, uh, yeah. I think the magnets got grinded up just a little bit. So we're going to need new ones, and I'm going to quit talking and end the video because I'm about to run out of batteries, but, yeah. And the inside of the flywheel. This is completely black. And this is the it's all the soot comes off of it like a chimney. It's pretty crazy. Kind of grind it up. So probably gonna need new magnets and new whatever it's called, stator rotor. Take the outside of the rotor because it rotates and the inside's a stator because it's stationary. I don't know how that goes. Might be the other way around. And I'm gonna call it